Hi, I'm Shane with the Drum Center of Portsmouth in Portsmouth, New Hampshire. We're on the web at drumcenternh.com. Uh, we're doing a video shootout today of the Yamaha Recording Custom Drums and the Sakai Almighty Birch, which are very close related cousins, as uh, many of you know. Um, the Sakai Rhythm Factory in Osaka, Japan, manufactured the Yamaha-designed Recording Custom Drums uh, for a number of years, uh, up until the, uh, the end of the road for them. Um, and so at that point, they launched their own brand, and they have uh, several lines of drums. They have the Almighty Birch is one, is one of them, and, and uh, Yamaha has redesigned and taken over the manufacturing of the recording custom drums. So what we uh, have are two pretty similar but different animals. The Yamaha is uh, a North American birch now. They always were the Hokkaido Japanese birch, which is what the Sakai is. So... Uh, we have the same thin triple flange tubes, but they also have a weighted lug on the recording customs, and there are uh, round, round, uh, rounded bearing edges on the recording customs, which they used to be sharp. So there is some significant differences between the new recording customs and the old ones, um, whereas the Al Almighty Birch is a little bit closer to the original recording custom, um, although the bass drum is significantly uh, much more powerful uh, I would attribute that to uh, the venting and the thinner uh, counter uh, hoop on each side of the bass drum. But I mean, the note on the Sakai kit, I would say, is a little bit longer. Uh, they're a little more aggressive sounding. The recording customs, these have a more focused, contained sound. Um, my assumption is that engineers and other people in the uh, band would probably prefer the recording custom drums because these are designed for microphones, live or in the studio. These, they're perfectly contained, uh, whereas the Sakai kit has a little more aggression, more attack, um, and I would say they might be a little more pleasing to some drummers who perhaps hit harder. But again, you might have the exact opposite uh, reaction. At the end of the day, they're both incredible sounding kits. They sound very similar. Uh, I can't say, I, people keep asking me, what do you like better? And I, I really can't say because they're both awesome sounding drums. I could find myself really enjoying either of them. There is a bit of a head difference on these two kits. The Sakai's have a clear Power Stroke 3 where the recorded custom has a coated Power Stroke 3. So that's pretty similar. But the Sakai kit has clear Emperors on the Toms, which is a two-ply clear head. And the recording customs have a coated Ambassador which is a single ply coated head. So there is gonna be a bit of a difference there. Uh, the clear heads are gonna be a little bit more of a wet attack, the coated's a little bit more controlled. But I hope you get the idea, and I hope it translates well to video. And if you have any questions, give us a call, uh, because we know this stuff pretty well. <laughs> we love it.